Good day, YouTube. This is a comparison video between Elementary OS on the left and Lubuntu on the right. So grab your Stein of coffee and let's get started. Okay, so starting off on the left hand side, we've got the Elementary OS here and uh, Lubuntu 20.10 on the right. So getting into it, first of all, they are actually based on uh, Ubuntu or Ubuntu there. Although this one here on the left elementary is based on a slightly older version. So the, uh, the long-term service release, whereas Lubuntu latest release 20.10 is just um, based on the next iteration after the long-term service release of Ubuntu, if that makes much sense at all. Now, uh, moving on, they are both uh, point releases. So they are updated every six months or so. They do have different desktop environments. So we've got the, the in-house homegrown Pantheon desktop environment, a little bit Mac OS there, as you can see. Whereas on the right-hand side, we've got the Lubuntu. It used to be based on LXDE. These days, it's based on the LXQT uh, desktop environment, or should I say toolkit there. So uh, yeah, nice and uh, built from the ground up, essentially. Very lightweight there. The file managers are a little bit different as well. Now, we've got the, uh, the in-house Gala file manager here, but they will look a little bit the same. We do have on the Lubuntu side, the uh, pack uh, sorry, the PC Man FM file manager, really, really lightweight, uh, quite basic, but you know, it still does most of the things you'd want it to do. Moving on, the kernel is actually the 5.4 kernel on elementary OS because it is running on a slightly older version of Ubuntu on the back end, whereas 5.8 on the right hand side here. Uh, just checking the RAM, 364 megabytes of RAM on boot up, so not very much at all, nice to see. Whereas on the elementary side, we've got 633 megabytes of RAM. So really, really almost, not quite, but nearly double there. So that's about it guys, thanks for watching. Please comment, uh, like, subscribe, all of those nice things and I do hope to see you guys there in the next one. Cheers.